Hi people and hello my Chili Con Carnage crew, Chili here from 5 Minute Reviews for Melted Milk's album Dada Dante. Melted Milk is an odd band, and an odd band needs an odd name to represent that fact. I mean, how do I surmise this band in a few short sentences? They're too poppy to be considered avant-garde. They're too avant-garde to be considered pop music. So I did the only humane thing that I could. So after that bath, I ended up writing this review. A review on a band that was recommended to me by a viewer. To be honest, I've been a bit hesitant in doing this episode. Not because the music wasn't any good. It was. Well, I'm not exactly sure why I hesitated. I guess it just took a while for me to adapt to it. And I'm still not sure about it. Melted Milk are from New York, according to their band camp page, and from what I could surmise, it appears to be the work of a lone musician. There is a varying degree of DIY approach to their music, which is rather endearing, to be honest. The music crosses various genres across its short 23-minute runtime, but I prefer shorter albums which are better suited to this style of music. There are elements of synth-punk to pieces like Sad Pop Song or Hello, while simultaneously juggling hyperpop on state of bass. Sprinkled within the tracks are various meta-jokes, for example on Flyboy which samples The Simpsons. The music has also been described as dustpan grime, which again is a reference to British hip-hop and self-loathing, which is so British that I almost spit out my tea while reading that. Damn, that joke works on so many levels, it's unbelievable. I'm sure there are many more inside jokes here, but since I'm old, I probably don't get a lot of the references. Although, one of the album covers did use a still image from a Rugrats episode, and is that some kind of untapped meme source that I'm unaware of? Just asking out of curiosity. One of the songs that really caught my attention was the semi-spoken word piece called Psych that really could give Peaches a run for her money. It's a slow tempo, dirty piece that works so well. Also the line about dancing with years of joint pain. I mean, I feel personally attacked, but otherwise it's got some great lyrics. Honestly, I thought this was a sample of Peaches' works when I heard it and I tried to find the original song. Speaking of samples, I thought I heard a bit of Gary Newman's My Friends Are Electric for a split second on Surf Angel, which is my favourite track on this album. It's an awesome Cali sounding lo-fi tune with uneasy tension built by the synth section, and it's wickedly wonderful. This record to me sounds like an extent of personality from the creator in a very pure form. Their music doesn't conform to a standard, while at the same time, it does. It's a paradox of existential musical notes pieced together and laid out for the listener to approach. I can't say it's easy listening and songs like Dada Dante or Old Country Folk Song can just come across as music put through a meat grinder, but if you persevere, you might just enjoy what's on offer. This is for fans of bands who would enjoy The Garden but want less of a punk sound to it. Overall, I'm going to give this effort 5 million chilies on the spicy scale, with my favourite tracks being Sad Pop Song, Psych and Surf Angel. When it comes to Melted Milk, I guess what I feel about the music can be summed up by Leo. Well, gentlemen, you have my curiosity, but now you have my attention. Also, Anna, if you are watching, I would love to have you on the show sometime. And if you are up for that, reach out to me on Instagram. Thank you everyone for tuning in to this episode of 5 Minute Reviews. Do the socials, like this video, share it with your friends, subscribe if you haven't already, and as always, you stay spicy out there. Thank you for tuning in to this episode of Live Listener Race. And if you have enjoyed this episode, make sure you share it with all your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our Chili Con Carnage crew so you can get notified for all the future videos that we put out, as we put out videos every Friday. Also, we are on Discord, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter over at Live Listener Race, so make sure to tune in over there. And don't forget to like this video so that our manager can stay very happy.